weird people every time I come here. How are the sports teams doing these days? Are they good? We had a guy quit. We had a guy quit the football team to do uh, the well, step sing. When I, the first time I ever did stand-up comedy was in Atlanta, Georgia, at a comedy club, and I had signed up for the open mic, and they were like, "You're on in a month." So like, we got, we don't have open availabilities till a month. So I remember not sleeping, not eating, uh, sweating a lot. Before my performance, I threw up in the bathroom actually before because it's like it takes. Every mental capacity is like, I don't know if there, I used to do a lot of like uh, risky behavior, daredevil type like ride motorcycles or bungee jump and there's no greater adrenaline rush than stand up comedy. You saw it last night and it's like ladies and gentlemen, John Chris and you walk out. People could watch my show and be like, a lot of my videos on the internet, that's hilarious but I love this church, it's just like come as you are, you know what I'm saying? How do I look though? Does the jacket go with the shirt? Maybe we shouldn't be so seeker sensitive in church or maybe we shouldn't. And then so it's like, it's like, a, uh, like the best comics that you, that your, your favorites are like, dude, that's a joke, but that's, that's so true. The theme this year is gonna be rustic denim in front of a barn. Do we live in the suburbs? Yes. Have we ever been to a barn? No. But I thought it would make perfect sense for a Christmas photo. The thing about comedy is to, to have new, anything, any, any job to have new ideas, thoughts, inspiration, motivation, creativity. You gotta have new things coming in here. Put something new in there to keep this thing like churning and moving. And, and if, if you can do that, you can, you can go anywhere. Sanford, why are you guys here? It's a Tuesday. <laughs>